Hello everyone, my name is Fajar Purnama and on this video I would like to try using change now to change my coins. So basically change now is a non-custodial exchange with the purpose to make your exchange experience as simple as possible where you don't need to do any email registration or a phone registration. If you are any on my blog, website or article, just click this link and then you will directly go to change now without any registration so here i want to try exchanging 5 usdt uh, to silica i have my 5 usdt usd my tether usd in exodus wallet five dollars and some ethereum for the transfer fee and although i can just exchange my usdt here but unfortunately silica is not available on on exodus wallet so i have a silica wallet here on the online or a web wallet which is on select.io for this video demonstration purpose and now i would like to try to exchange my 5 usdt to 227 silica now let's give it a try so here i choose usdt here i choose silica and then put five dollars and then exchange and then so this is a this is also my first time so let's see here so please enter the detail of the exchange is one already this one already okay the recipient wallet so instead of a registration they just uh, ask for your receiving wallet right, uh, right away so next please confirm the detail of the exchange the estimate arrival time is 2 to 40 minutes and make sure that you're on change now that I owe okay confirm okay and now is to deposit 5 USDT into here to this address so copy this address and then go to my exodus and then send oh okay let me fix this let me continue and paste the address and then all of them and then send and then that is done so let's see if it's uh, receiving its deposit i will pause okay after a while so the deposit is received so i check the transaction from enter scan and io this is the transaction has you can go to exodus and click here and then maybe it needs like two block confirmation okay so exchange is complete now and then it's sending to your wallet i'll pause again and then wait okay after a few minutes the transaction is complete and here it is um let's take a look what this is okay so it is on etherscan.io2 Oh wait, this is the USDT, which is now exchange, and now this one is the from the seal wallet. So from here is the transaction information, but anyway, it is supposed to be received. Now let's check, refresh. Okay, so I have to reconnect and then there you go i have my 226 silica transfer to my wallet transactions and here it is so it's done so there is no need for kyc maybe only for suspicious transaction i think because here on their website let's go back to change now 
that is actually a section about KYC AML and and know your customer and time money laundering so there are some transactions that I read over here that requires uh, KYC so in short for in the summary after I, I read all of this if I think KYC is only necessary for suspicious transactions and here I'm only uh, exchanging five US dollar which is almost nothing for them maybe if I exchange like a thousand or even a million dollar then I may need to go to the KYC procedure anyway that's that so that is how simple it is again no email registration phone registration deposit is only for the payment and there is no need for withdrawal request like on the custody exchange it's actually much easier using built-in wallet but as you can see uh oh it's lagging again and here i have my guarda wallet as you can see I can just uh, keep my coins here and then use the built-in exchange but their built-in exchange here in Guarda is actually based on change now so if you are a developer you have a wallet you can build a internal exchange a built-in exchange using change now API well that is that so i don't want to keep this long thank you